based on the recent video where I have been showing you how to create a scenery as quick as possible, I'd like to focus now how to handle the light in an effective manner. I would like to do some office lighting design. We can move on to implementing the luminaires. I would like to use lights like this one, that one, that one, that one, that one. There are many of those. You can take them from the catalogs. There is a number of catalogs available. If you don't have it, go to additional catalogs and you'll be finding the list of available catalogs that we have. There are about 200 of them. So now I can go and also import a luminaire. And if you have not already chosen one of these luminaires, you should do it now. That will be the one I would like to use for illuminating these office places. I would like to have two of those above each table. So I define this as the distance as the surface to be illuminated. The computer makes a proposal of three. I'll change that number to two. And I can see here that each of these panels is one meter twenty long. Change this to one twenty. This place as the distance. So one is next to the other. This is one way you could do it. If you don't want to use this luminaire but another, I can replace them using this icon. Can use this one or that one. I change to this one, I do it in the same manner once again. I can recalculate the installation so this one is suspended, the other half been integrated in the acoustic element. Distance 1207, so I change the distance in this place. I've got one next to the other. And like before, I can use the copy and paste arrangement insert those luminaires. Now let's have a closer look. They're now suspended rather close below the acoustic element. If I want to change the height, I'll be finding the mountain type here. That's in the suspension length as it is initially defined by the manufacturer. If I want to change it, I can either change it in this place or change the mounting place height there. So that's the way I want it to be 2.25 meters above the people's heads. Be careful, you cannot copy and paste together at once luminaires and objects. So if I want to have the objects, the furniture here, I have to do it separately from copying the luminaires. Those two can never be copied together. So I want to have those furnitures here. I want to go here, copy over them to the other place. That's the way this area looks like. Just to give the camera to have first impression of that, I suggest you start the calculation process. As you can see, this shall not take more than probably 30 seconds. Then you have the exact calculation of all the surfaces of all the interiors and even the exterior if there is an exterior of this ambience. You see how well it is illuminated. If I place my mouse on two point without doing anything, I can see at the right bottom that I have 601 lux on this point of the table, which should be enough for an office. Let's have a look there. That's 400 lux here. 560. 778 in this place. So I can assume that I'm on the right track. That's going to be right at the end. So in this manner, I can create the entire exterior. And there's a big advantage for which you can use if you're using Dialux Evil. Select these. I copy them. Of course, the results are not correct anymore. Move them over. 
and I may now continue the calculation process and save a little bit of time. I would like to have a look now with you together at the final result. This is a way that you can do the project. It should not take you more than probably 30, 40 minutes to create the entire project. I have been using these lights to illuminate the tables, also in a diagonal manner. I have been adding several spotlights, which we have here, which are asymmetrical, giving me the option to have very narrow illumination of scallops along the wall by illuminating very well this place. I've done that along this wall and that wall. And we have a canteen over here, which is also illuminated. And you see how spotlights are pointing exactly onto the tables. You see very well on this place too. They're slightly rotated on this place. You can see how well determined this circle of light is in this place, creating more atmosphere so people will feel more comfortable using this place. And to get an overview about how well we fulfill the rules, you can see we have values in the region of 500 lux on all the tables, 500 between 705, 750 lux on all the tables, all in yellow colors. You see here very well the effect of the spotlights, giving accents on the walls and illuminating sufficiently the space in front of the walls. Back to this. Well, this is about how well you can use luminaires to create such good office situation.